In this video, we will determine the pH of the given solution using the Q and hydrogen electrode. In the previous video, we used the hydrogen electrode, and in this video, we will use the Q and hydrogen electrode. So, first of all, what is Q and hydrogen? Q and hydrogen is a crystal which, upon dissolving in water, dissociate into quinone and hydroquinone. Okay, so this is quinone. This is quinone and this is hydroquinone. And the quinone, when react with the hydrogen ion, it converts into hydroquinone. This is the equation. Okay, this is how the quinone reacts with the H ion uh, to convert to uh, hydroquinone. And this is the basis of why do we use the hydroquinone electrode to determine the H ion concentration because of this particular reaction. So how will you write the AMF of the Nernst uh, equation of this uh, reaction? E naught of the cell is equals to E naught minus. Here I am just denoting the E of the cell by this hydroquinone symbol. Why? Because E of the cell. Sorry. Okay, that doesn't matter. Okay. Uh, e is equals to E naught minus R T upon two F ln two is because here two electron are used and activity of hydroquinone divided by activity of quinone and activity of H ion concentration raised to the power 2. Now in aqueous solution the activities of hydroquinone and quinone uh, are equal so these two terms cancel out and now only we get this E is equals to cell uh, E cell is equals to E naught cell minus RT upon 2 F ln 1 upon activity of H ion concentration. Now as 1 upon uh, this term uh, uh, using this formula this term can be written like this now finally it becomes E is equals to E naught minus RT upon 2 ln activity of H plus minus 2 now as we know that ln X minus 2 uh, it can be written as minus 2 ln X so here this minus 2 will be multiplied uh, multiplied uh, here and the equation becomes E naught minus RT upon 2 F minus 2 ln activity of H and H plus ion. Now this minus minus term become plus and 2 cancel out. So finally E is equals to E naught plus 2 RT upon upon 2 F ln activity of H ion. Now this 2 cancel out and finally we get E naught plus RT upon F ln activity of H plus ion. Now at 25 degree Celsius that is at um, at 25 degree Celsius this equation can be written as E naught plus 2.303 into R into 298 25 plus 273 becomes 298. So log A activity of H plus ion and which finally uh, becomes E naught plus 0 0.0591 log H plus ion concentration as activity can be also written as H ion concentration in certain conditions. Okay, so uh, this can be modified like this E naught minus multiplied by minus because this minus minus finally will become plus 0 0.0591 log H plus ion concentration and minus log H plus ion concentration is equals to pH. So this equation becomes E is equals to E naught Q minus 0 0.0591 pH. Okay. Now value of this standard uh, value of standard EMF of Q non is 0 0.6196. So we put it here. So finally we get the EMF of quin hydron electrode is 0 0.696 minus 0 0.0591 pH. Okay. Now we will connect this half electrode with the reference electrode to make a complete cell. And then we will determine the EMF of this complete cell and put it into the formula. Now this cell will be constructed. Here is your quin hydron electrode. And here is the reference electrode okay that is the calomel electrode right now uh, the, um, as it was in hydrogen electrode the quin hydron electrode um, uh, this half cell is constructed like this a solution whose pH is to be determined um, is uh, contains some amounts of quin hydrogen some contains some amount of crystals of quinhydron and platinum wire it dipped in that uh, solution okay now e of the emf of this cell will be written like this 
ई एम एफ ऑफ राइट हैंड साइड इलेक्ट्रोड माइनस ई एम एफ ऑफ ई एम एफ ऑफ लेफ्ट हैंड साइड इलेक्ट्रोड ई एम एफ ऑफ राइट हैंड साइड इलेक्ट्रोड विच जस्ट कैलकुलेटेड दैट इज जीरो पॉइंट सिक्स डबल नाइन सिक्स माइनस जीरो पॉइंट जीरो फाइव नाइन वन पी एच विल पुट दिस वैल्यू हेयर एंड दिस इज लेफ्ट हैंड साइड इलेक्ट्रोड इज द कैमल इलेक्ट्रोड हुज वैल्यू वी ऑलरेडी नो दैट इज माइनस दैट इज जीरो पॉइंट टू फोर वन फाइव एंड अपॉन सॉल्विंग वी गेट जीरो पॉइंट जीरो फोर फाइव एट वन माइनस जीरो पॉइंट जीरो फाइव नाइन वन पी एच नाउ और अपॉन रीअरेंजिंग दिस पर्टिकुलर इक्वेशन वी गेट पी एच इज इक्वल्स टू जीरो पॉइंट फोर फाइव एट वन माइनस ई ई इज द ई एम एफ ऑफ द कम्प्लीट सेल टोटल ई एम एफ ऑफ द सेल डिवाइडेड बाय जीरो पॉइंट जीरो फाइव नाइन वन और इन जनरल वी कैन राइट पी एच इज इक्वल्स टू ई नॉट क्यू माइनस ई कैलमल माइनस ई सेल अपॉन जीरो पॉइंट जीरो फाइव नाइन वन ओके Uh, the advantage of this uh, quin hydron electron is uh, quin hydron electrode is that it it is easy to handle and easy to set up and in hydrogen electrode you always have to maintain the uh, at one atmospheric pressure but there is no requirement of maintaining such kind of pressure it is easy to handle but the limitation of this cell is that this particular equation we um, this uh, Nonst equation, which uh, we have already written for uh, as the nonst equation of hydrogen elect of quin hydron electrode. So this particular equation, which tells the relation between the EMF of the cell and pH of the solution, is valid only uh, in the acidic medium. In alkaline medium, this equation becomes independent of the pH. Okay, so this is the limitation of this. कोई हाइड्रोन इलेक्ट्रोन ओके